Hey guys, it's Stormy and Chas Jonathan <laughs> in this piece. I can put you in my hot club. What's up? Let's take a trip. <laughs> Good morning. I hope everyone is doing great today. We're um, this is day five or six. This is day five. Day five. Six. 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 Oh, this is day six of our trip. And as you can see, there's bags under my eyes. Not for sure why. But yeah. So we are about to head to get breakfast. Please <laughs> <laughs> touch my apple. Yeah. <laughs> okay, YouTube. So we're at the special education school in Guatemala. We're about to meet these kids. So we just got back to Antigua, Guatemala. We were in uh, San Martin and what is this? Furniture store? Nice. Um, anyways, we were in San Martin and we just got back to Antigua and this is our last full day. And that bag is nice. This is like the more expensive side. I mean, it's not expensive, but it's definitely not cheap in San Martin because those people are struggling. These people have money, basically. <laughs> We just bought some like snacks and stuff for a video that we're gonna make and um Stormy has the bubble gloves so if she's not smiling it's because she's about to shit on herself. Yeah, I don't feel so well. You know how you already don't wanna go somewhere that you don't feel comfortable. Now you got to feel Ooh, ice cream. That's the same ice cream that he shot yesterday. Oh really? Yeah, sorry time. So that ends our shopping in Antigua. No, we're gonna go back, aren't we? Or are we hey, just gonna go sit down? We have to go. Oh no, it's going after our boo-boo. Are we just gonna do that? Are we gonna 
gonna come back after you boo boo? Yeah. Have a way. Yeah. But yeah, um, camera's getting low, so I'm about to charge it up. It's like two o'clock, I believe. It's like two o'clock. Yeah, it's like 2:40. Oh, it's like three o'clock, and um, woo. -hoo. So now it's the race to the bathroom. <laughs> Not fun. Isn't this city beautiful, you guys? Very I just don't like that it's so touristy. Like the Sakalaha and Chatalum and um, all the cities we've been to, San Martina, all these cities have been very cultural and traditional. And this city's just like Caucasians. <laughs> I even saw some black people. So that's just not, yeah, that's not the real deal. But I do like that the food here is probably clean because. There's so many white people here. But they have to keep the food clean. Hold it in. Hold on. Yeah. <laughs> also, a lot of the salesmen here speak English or try to. Mm -hmm. They don't do that in the other ones. Like, you need to look Spanish. You need to at least, you know, say something in Spanish. They'll try to communicate with you. Finished, but here they're just like, what do you like? What do you want to buy? Like, mm. Stomachs up. So how you feeling? I'm putting this on YouTube. I'm putting this on YouTube. This about to be the <laughs> title of the video. Stormy shitting on herself in and, 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 uh, Antigua. Are you family? Nah. No family. Only friends. Oh, okay. Okay, I see now. Why only one piece for me? Ah, see. I have her feelings. Well, like this one, this is the brand. Now, see what she feels like. Now, this one makes you feel bad. What you said earlier did not. You look not broken. You look not broke? We are. We broke. Broke in America. Broke in America. Not broke in Guatemala, broke in America. This one, this is the bracelet. Oh, bracelet. Yeah, bracelet. Huh? I'm not going to put it up. Yeah. But I feel bad because you guys. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I thought they had family. Oh, they too. How much is this? Long five get this. Okay, well. Let's see. The bracelet is this one. Okay. She said four, four, five, or six, whatever. You have change? Yeah. A hundred? How much you want? And they see if you have a hundred. Uh-huh. Wait till, wait till we break it with her. Okay. We'll give you the rest. I mean, all the rest. We'll get one of those. Only <laughs> one? Yes. Then get some. No! You hustler! Hustler! Do you want one of those? Yeah. Girl, good. I don't have to have a bracelet like that. I would break it anyways. They give you a rainbow one? Because you're gay? No, I asked for this. Oh, okay. I was like, oh, that's childish. Kind of cliche though for me, huh? Yeah. So no. It's cliche. Yeah. Get some love. Are you? You ain't gonna want to wear that every day. Huh? Bali? Um. Where did you from? What did she say? Where am I from? Oh, Tejas. Let's see. Let's see. Um, I like those, but those aren't bracelets, are they? Yeah. You're gonna break that, aren't you? Probably will break it. You gonna put it back? What are you doing? I was just holding this stuff for you. This one? This is the This is the best color. Oh, nope. Nope. <laughs> she own it. Huh? Huh? The bank? Yeah, what do you want? Hold, hold. 
Okay, we'll be right back. Folks, do you want to hold it? I'm going to go to a bank. Bank. Huh? Right here. Yeah. yeah. I know it's right there. Okay. You have change? Mm -hmm. Huh? Right. Hold that. You see this? People are uh, checking on the little baby. What do you got for me? Go pay it again. Everybody on your team very, very well right now. You probably cried together, you probably laughed together, you've been everywhere together. So now what? Well, as you are ready to re-enter the real world, there's some, some real things I want to talk to you about. You're going to want to go home and you're going to want to share your experience with everybody and anybody that you potentially can. Let me give you a couple of warnings. They're not going to get it. Why? They weren't there. And uh, as badly as you're going to want to spend hours showing your pictures and things like that, my suggestion to you is wow. get one of the videos that might be two or three or four minutes long that they put together. It's probably on YouTube by now. And, and make sure you just show that. Just let people know that, that you made the commitment, that you were out there, and that, that you were there. Pink Stay in touch cool. with your team. Get as many emails as you can. Get telephone numbers. <laughs> Stay in touch with each other. Another thing that you can do as far as the business goes, you know what? Um, I'm a red personality, but because of my experiences in Guatemala and building the schools and being involved with the children, I have become much more effective in dealing with that personality that's the, 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 the least like mine. Why? Now I'm cause-oriented. I can still see the eyes and the faces of those kids. And when I explain that in a meeting, what that was like mm -hmm. and the way that it impacts people's lives, it becomes compelling to those people that maybe in the past I haven't been able to reach in, in a very good way. And in conclusion, let me just say this to you. Um, from the bottom of my heart, I can't tell you how much I appreciate the fact that you've taken your time and your money and have come down to spend it with us here in Guatemala. I wish that I was there because the emotion that you feel right now and the gratitude oh, wow. that you have uh, from what you just went through is, is very, 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 very powerful. And for that, I want to thank you. And I hope that you'll come back, be a part of a reunion uh, class that comes back. More leaders will rise out of this. I'm already crying. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> I, I didn't think I was going to do that. But um, what I want to say is that um, this trip has truly changed my life. Um, a lot of times you get distracted by everything that's going on in your life. And um, it's over. I feel like over the course of a year, I just became a different person, a person that I wasn't, a person who I wasn't. Anyways, so this trip has brought me back to who you know I am and it has humbled me and um you know I didn't think in 2015 people still live that way they do but they do and it just changed my whole entire perspective on a lot of things um oh, well, I remember the first night when we got here and we sat down at this table it was like oh my god this is kind of like weird you know we don't know a lot of people <laughs> and then I sit down at this table a week later and I'm like saying goodbye to my family like Andy I came so close to him and the and I mean, it's just, it's, this trip has completely, it completely um, changed my life. You know, like I said before, leaving that village and that older lady that reminded me kind of like of my mom and when she hugged me like i felt so much love in her like saying like thank you so much and we can understand what we're saying but i went and found her on facebook last night and the little boy that kept saying tormenta tormenta is her son i didn't even know that <laughs> it was amazing thank y'all <laughs> my expectations. I remember when I, said, um, I came here last week and they said, what do you expect? I said, I guess I don't really know what to expect, you know? And I mean, I guess I get just that. I didn't really know that that was going to happen. 
Now, I figured this trip would be more like, oh, this will be fun. We're going to, you know, take some good Instagram pictures. We're going to build this school. And at first, I didn't think we were going to actually have to do Sydney. I thought we were going to do <laughs> And back then, when people were like, what are you going to do to build it? I'm like, oh, probably just like, you know, some small stuff. No, we're out there mixing cement in the rain. <laughs> but, um, that was actually the best part. That was literally the best part. We were all working together as a team, mixing cement in the rain, cold, gig sick. It was, it was awesome. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I didn't know. I didn't really know what to expect. I didn't think that we could bond with people without the language. I didn't think that we'd actually, you know, I don't know. I just didn't think it would feel like that. And to go to a village and see kids for you know two days, and when you leave, they're showering gifts at you, and they don't even have anything to give you. It's it's definitely you know, we were all crying. I'm pretty sure you guys weren't crying tears of sadness, but it's just crazy that. You know, we got to experience something like this. You know, this is pretty much, I, did, I never thought I would experience anything like this. And like I said, I just didn't know what to expect. So um, I'm just really glad I went on this trip. And I definitely am going to go home and tell every single person, like he said, don't do it. <laughs> I'm going to be like, look, you just got to go. But <laughs> I'm going to do the two-hour picture thing, okay? <laughs> Thank you. That's all, folks. That's my line. Step aside, babe. Let a star do this. That's all! That's all, folks! Can I go home now?